Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 16th of September 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, it's Saturday evening here. We're just starting to get dark, so it's still early evening. Um, and I uh, hope you are enjoying your weekend. Uh, why do Americans like the word coffee so much that they call places after it? <laughs> Actually, coffee is ra rather a nice sounding word, isn't it? The word itself. You know, do you not notice how some words seem to have a, a nice resonant sound or a beauty just to the word itself? Actually, I rather like the um, strange pronunciation that they have in i think it's new york or new jersey it's the kind of coffee <laughs> i really like the way that they say that sounds great um anyway uh coffee county is the place in georgia with all of the uh news headlines about um you know the fake electors blah 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 in georgia but um uh, in my youtube feed i got um uh, a local TV channel, a kind of omnibus edition of um, investigations that they've been following in Coffee City, which I believe is in um, Texas. And uh, the population size of this place um, is small. When I say small, uh, act to be accurate, 249 residents in, <laughs> in the town. Uh, one short of 250. Uh, but apparently they'd employed a police chief who decided to hire 50 police officers and around half of the people that he hired um, seemed to have rather dodgy backgrounds, meaning that they'd either been kicked out of other police forces or they'd been charged with some criminal offence or something like that or, um, you know, been forced to resign uh, over misconduct or something like that. Hmm. Sounded very dodgy. The local residents were kind of complaining that the police were running around in cars finding people everywhere, you know, running tickets and stuff like that, making money seemed to be a profitable en enterprise. Some of the, but the, uh, well, the reason I mentioned it is because the local TV station seemed to have done a really good job. They, um, the, as I said, I watched like an omnibus edition. They just showed like reports over several weeks that they'd been running and they put them all together in one long show. Uh, and you can see how the investigation developed, you know, from the initial conversation with the police chief who seemed to be very, reasonable at first in his interview saying oh I was just giving people a chance then you can see he, some body cam footage of him like uh, threatening somebody looking angry and you know like a, the other side the side that you don't often see that kind of thing and uh, you know it just went on and then um, anyway so finally there were more and more investigations into what had been going on and in the end the police chief was sacked fired I guess Americans say and uh, so was the entire police um, division. They, <laughs> they, they kicked the whole lot of them out and said they're going to have to start again, find someone new and hire new people. Wow. Coffee City. Anyway, it's a lot of fun for those of us that don't live in America watching that kind of stuff. So thank you to the local TV station for your diligent work. Um, difficult to find such coverage nowadays, though. That's the trouble because... Um, I think uh, it's, uh, you know, news, local news reporting is so difficult. Many local news um, television stations in, in the U.S. have been taken over by major companies as well with right-wing agendas as well. Um, that's unfortunate. But anyway, good luck to those investigative reporters. Right, okay, this is the Los Angeles Times expert level game. Those of you new to the channel... Welcome. This is a game I often play. Right. In I'm going to start with digit one because I can see these ones blocking up here and this one blocking those squares there. That's going to give me a one in that square. In fact, we're going to continue the ones across like this and up there and that's going to give me a one in that square. A one down here and across these two rows means we can place digit one there. Uh, okay, let's try the twos. That's looking good. We've got twos up there and across there, which will give me a two there. We have two down here, two across there and across there, which means this will be a two. 
Uh, where were those ones a moment ago? Let me... Yeah, okay, so one blocking down here and down here now, so that means here's our one. Looks like we can finish them off because I had some restrictions. Yeah, yeah, it's true. There goes the one. So one is finished. Right, let's move on to the two, see if we can do anything else. I don't think so, but never know your luck. Okay, three... Uh, yes, two, four, two, four, two, four. How about that? We got ourselves a pair of two and four there. What does it mean? It means the fives are going to be in these squares. Let's see. No. Oh. No, that's not going to help much, is it? Oh, well, never mind. Uh, let me, what did I say? I've lost it now. Two, four in those squares. Uh, how about the eights? Eights will be like that. Is that going to give me much? No. That's a shame. Got something and I don't know what to do with it. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Two, four, I said, didn't I? Two, four? Yes, two, four. Oh, so the three's blocking up here. That's going to put threes in those squares. So three down here, down here, and across there will give me a three in that square. Three across here, three across here. There's a three. Okay. Oh good, four across here will give me four in that square there. Four across here and across here and down there will give me a four in that square. Four up here, four down there. Means that you must be a four. And four blocking this square, four blocking this square. So in this row that will be a four. Uh, these will be seven, nine I think. And I don't know which is which. But we'll keep it in mind if we can remember. Um, okay, I've got something missing here, which is five and eight. So let's look and see what goes here then. This is going to be 9 and 7, 7, 9. Okay, so we've got the 9 blocking down here. That must be our 9. This must be our 7. Seven blocking up here, 7 across there. There's our 7. Five blocking up here will give me a five in that square. Five blocking down here and across here means that that is a five. Missing numbers here and here a six, eight, I think. We've got the eight blocking down here. That must be an eight. This will be a six. Six blocks across here, six down here. There's a six. Missing number here, uh, nine, I think. Um, uh, 
six blocking across here that puts six into that square this will be a three three blocks this square here that must be a three the last number to place here is a nine nine down here nine up here there's a nine nine across here nine up there there's a nine and the last number for this column is it a six no it's not um what is it then is it a three i think it is um okay doing quite well what's missing from here we're looking for six seven eight i think we got six and eight there so that's going to be a seven then isn't it and the missing digit here is going to be a nine nine blocking up here nine up here nine across there there's a nine final nine in fact seven blocks this square here we don't have seven in this column yet let's put it in now missing digit here is an eight we also need an eight to finish there eight across here and eight up here will give us an eight in that square eight blocking down gives us eight here this is a five five up here five across there there's a five five come on hmm. Uh, we need a five in the top row don't we that blocks five up there so that's going to be a five missing number here I have no idea seven uh, what do we need here is two four is it uh, oh, that doesn't help down here let's see what have we got in the middle here nines no fives ones that's all done down here eights done sevens Nope, that sevens are gonna be like that. Fours, nines, fives. Oh, I'm just gonna go through them. Let's see. Twos. Can we do anything about twos? Yes we can. Two up here, two down here. That gives me a two in that square. Now there's only one number missing up here, which is a three, I think. Okay missing here one five no can't be five and six five blocking up here there's a five and this would be a six six blocking down here giving me the six there six across here means that's a six the missing number here eight eight across here eight up here there's an eight we can play and two blocking across here means that's two two blocking up here means that's two the missing number here four i think four blocking down here gives me a four there uh here we need a seven seven blocks across here there's our seven and uh three we'll finish it that's our los angeles times expert level game for saturday uh see you around bye bye